Welcome back. Today we're going to have Akinator guess some more reptiles. So we are going to put them on animals. And I feel like the first reptile that we should have him guess, we started last time with a gecko. We started with Crest Gecko. So now let's go with something uh, a little bit more obscure. Let's see if he knows the Toke Gecko. I like the Toke Gecko a lot. They're very aggressive. They're very angry animals. Um, used to know a guy, he used to have a saying, he said, um, uh, I've, t I've held a lot of reptiles, but the only one I've ever felt hatred from the reptile towards me is the Toke Gecko. So that's a great way to describe it. Um, Toke Geckos are very aggressive. Uh, they have a hell of a bite force and they, their jaws lock like a pit bull. And their scientific name is Gecko Gecko. So they're like the, the like official gecko. So let's do that. No, Toke geckos don't have paws. Uh, can your animal easily fit in a car? Yes. Uh, can they stand on two legs? Nope. Has your animal got legs? Yeah, they got legs, all right. Do they live in the water? No. They live on walls or you know, on trees. Is your animal an insect? Nope. They eat insects. Yes. No beard. Mm, they can be green, but, uh, God, I'm colorblind. To me, they kind of look just like, I, I don't, I don't know. Uh, yes, they can be found in pet stores. Yes, they do have sticky feet. Yeah, they change colors. They can go from, like, a really dark to, like, an almost a white. Uh, curly tail? No, not really. Is your animal a pet? No. You can keep them as a pet. I have a toke gecko. And then tails aren't particularly long. Not poisonous. They just bite really hard. They'll make you bleed. Uh, not an amphibian. I already said it was a reptile. Yes, you can find it in a pet shop. Loud? Well, they do vocalize. They do kind of scream. But no, not really loud. Live in trees. Yes. Eat berries. Definitely not. Very carnivorous. Uh, no. Oh, yes. Striped tail. Yeah, they do have a striped tail. Uh, usually caged. No, usually they're found in the wild. This seems like a cop-out on, like, the highest degree. No. <laughs> Get the hell out of here, Akinator. Is it a lizard? No, 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 no. You have to say Toke Gecko. Yeah, they got toes. All the... All 20 of them. Uh, no, they don't look like a plant. Can your can your animal be green? Yes. Is your animal really slow? No. Spikes? No. They kind of have dimples on their body. Yes, they do have spots. Predator? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, no, not yellow. Uh, is your animal brown? Uh, it can be, so probably. Does your animal like cages? Oh, no. Spots on its face. Yes, toke geckos do have spots on their face. Uh, does your animal live in the human body? That shit would be terrifying. No. <laughs> uh, big legs. No, not big legs. Noisy, not really. Do you own your animal? How does he know what I own? Yes. Do you own your animal? What a weird question. He doesn't... Can Akinator see in my house? What the fuck? <laughs> no, they're not generally yellow. Does your animal use pseudopodia to move? No, it is... What, what is pseudopodia? That's like what uh, an amoeba uses, right? No. Is your animal from Yorkshire? No. Does your animal have a white tip tail? Okay, gecko. Oh, why didn't not? Uh, there we go. Uh, this is what Toke geckos look like. Do they have a white tip tail? I like kind of. That's kind of a white tip, right? 
Sometimes. I'm going to say probably. Do they bark? Surprisingly? Yes. Do, do they have hairs? No hairs. Found only in Romania. No. No, 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 no. They're found in uh, Southeast Asia. Does your animal eat other animals? Yep. Anything that can fit in its mouth and moves. No buzzing sound. Hey, it found it! Oh, this toke gecko is a regrown tail. It's a pretty bad picture of a toke gecko. Why, why wouldn't you pick a prettier one? Like the one with rolls. I like the one with rolls. Where, where was the one with rolls? This one this is my favorite picture of a toke gecko. I've seen it a lot. But look how squishy he looks. Yes. Nice work. Bit surprised, especially after it started out guessing lizard. But yeah. I'm pleased. All right. So the next one. What should we do next? There's so many to pick from. Hmm. We did Toke Gecko. What did we do last time? We did a Crested Gecko. We did a Tegu. And we did a uh, Frill Dragon. Okay. So let's do an Agamid. Uh, we did a, so we did a Gecko, an Agamid, and a Tegu. Because Tegus are kind of their own thing. So let's do an Agamid. Let's do um, uh, a Euromastix. So let's play again. Uh, if we're going specific, let's get an Asia, um, an a what the hell am I saying? A yellow Niger Euromastix. Uh, does your animal live in a house? It lives in my house, but no, not in a house. Four legs, yes. Sharp teeth, no. Euromastix are herbivores. They mainly eat uh, vegetables. In the wild, they eat these little flowers on bushes. Um... They and they also, when they're babies, they eat their mother's poop. Uh, is your animal smaller than a human? Yes, much smaller. Harry, nope. Live in the water? Nope. Yes. No. Yellow. Found in pet stores, occasionally, but not really. Uh, bigger than your foot? Uh, actually, we're about the same size, so no. Not bigger. Have a long tail? No, they got a spiky tail. Not an amphibian. Not an insect. Yes, they got a lot of spikes. Their tail is like a mace. Let me show you all a picture of the Euromastix. Should have probably done this in the last video. Euromastix. Yeah, so this is a, a yellow uh, Nitro Euromastix. Yeah, as you see, they got the they got the fat bodies, and they got a spiky tail. Their entire body is perfectly made to live in their environment. So they live in typically in canyons with rocks, and when they during the day they'll come down from their uh, from the canyon walls, which they wedge themselves in, and then they inflate themselves and wedge themselves in. And when another predator comes and sticks its nose into uh, where it's hiding, it'll take this spiky tail and it'll whip in their nose. Predator's nose is very sensitive. So then they'll run away. They won't want to deal with that. Man, they're slow, fat little animals. They need to be kept very hot. Like, their hot spot needs to be like 120 to 130 maximum, uh, minimum. So yeah, very pretty animals. This is a male. You can tell because of how uh, yellow it is. But yes, that's what we're uh, trying to get it to guess. So yes, it is a desert animal. Do they have glowing eyes? No. Is your animal a fish? No. Can your animal roll into a ball? No. Found in Australia? Nope. They are found in the Middle East and Africa. Very hot climate. In groups? No, not really. They can, but not really. Does your animal have blue and white fur? No. What animal has blue and white fur? Long tusks? No, but imagine that. Your mastics with like tusks? That'd be crazy. Drink blood. No, they like salad, not blood. Have more than one horn. Nope, no horns on these. No, no, no. I said no horn. Listen. Continue. Yes. Is your animal a pet? Not really. It can be. 
No, they're not venomous animals. Are they spiky? Well, their tails are, so I think that's a yes. Do they have scales? Yeah. Pretty much all reptiles have scales, with certain exceptions. Does your animal have natural armor? I would say that spiky tail counts as some sort of natural armor. Uh, does your animal have a white head? No. Heads typically the same color as their body. Have a long nose? No, they have a short, stout face. So, no, no, no. Large eyes? No, those are pretty small. Is your animal scary? No. Does your animal lay eggs? Yes. Still exist? Well, unless they disappeared out of my tank, they still exist. Uh, is your animal able to crush a crane? What kind of weird-ass question is this? Is your animal able to crush a crane? What kind of metrics are... Hmm. No, you said it was uh, smaller than my foot. But... Can it crush a crane? <laughs> no, it cannot crush a crane. Uh, are they available commercially? Yes. Typically wild-caught. Which, not the best. I want to try breeding mine so I can... uh put some captive bred uh, specimens into a market. Uh, no, they're not native to New Zealand. Does your animal use rocks as tools? No, they're not otters. Can they be found in a pet shop? Uh, not typically. Does your animal... No, they're cute. Is your animal from hell? Now it's just trying to insult me. It's like, fucking animal from hell. God damn it. You're trying to trick me. Uh, does your animal require a license to own? Nope. Do not live in Australia. Have you already held your animal in your hands? Yeah. Yeah. It, you know. You know what? She doesn't really like sitting with me, but yeah, I've held my animal in my hands. Good girl. I'm gonna put her back now because she doesn't really like being out. But yes, I've held my animal in my hands. So, yes, I just put her back. Uh, is your animal black and white? No, nope. they're yellow urimastics. Does your animal only have one eye? Nope, two on either side of her head. So, nope. Does your animal only have one eye? No. Uh, does your animal trot? No, they kind of just, like, crawl. Uh, does your animal hold onto a wall? No, not even a little bit. Hey, got it! And this is even a yellow Euromastix. This tank is not ideal. It's climbing higher to get to a basking light, but this looks like a juvenile. It looks okay. It's not terrible, but I would put... Euromastix typically like sand. They like to burrow. There's nowhere near enough hides in this tank. Looks kind of small as well. You want to make a night heat, heat gradient. But yes, Euromastix. And now for our final one. This may take a little Akinator a little longer. Uh, so far, every single one that we've done today, it has uh, always had one wrong guess before getting it right. So let's see if this last one, it can get it right without anything going wrong. So now we're going to try to get make it guess a red-eyed crocodile skink. Does your animal live in a house? No, it does not, Akinator. Have sharp teeth? Uh, not really. No, I've been bit by one before. Didn't bleed or anything. Uh, so no, no sharp teeth. They do vocalize. Uh, no wings, despite looking like a dragon. Uh, smaller than human? Much, much smaller. Live in the water? Uh, yeah, they're kind of amphibious. They'll live anywhere with high humidity. Uh, I probably just should have said probably to that. Should I restart? No. Uh, has your animal got legs? Yes, it does have legs. I just don't want to confuse Akinator. Does your animal clean other animals? No. Does your animal have four legs? I already said this. Uh, can your animal jump high? Not really. Kind of just chill. Does your animal have a beak? No. Yeah, it's it's sticking on the fact that I said it was in the water. No. Have a long tail? Not really. It has a tail, but not a long one. Is your animal microscopic? No. Discovered from fossil? No. Green? No. Heavy? Definitely not. Very small. 
Chew loudly. No. Amphibian. No. 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 Huh. No. I might... If we get to 30 and still, like, not narrowing it down. What the hell is an ohm? Uh, it is... It is not an ohm. <laughs> so some sort of amphibious thing? No. Continue. No. Uh, if you find uh, your character on a falling list, uh, let's see if it's here. Uh, it is not here. Yeah, I, I feel like I, I just made a mistake when I said it lives in the water because it technically does, but not all the time. Uh, my character is not on this list. Uh, I, I'm, I'm not going to tell you. I want to see if you get it right when I do it right. Uh, does your animal have paws? Nope. Four legs? Yes. Shorter than a horse? Definitely. Still exist? Absolutely. Raised in a farm? Nope. Does your animal have a trunk? Nope. Does your... God, I hope it doesn't often get hit by cars, but probably not. Uh, is your animal generally yellow? No. Oh, let me pull up a picture of them so you can see what they look like. Red-eyed crocodile skink. So this is what they look like. They look like our little dragons. Here's a picture of... <laughs> such a dumb picture. You, you shouldn't do this. This is um, a, a dumpty tree frog or a white tree frog sitting on top of one. Uh, they're kind of just chilling. Uh, doesn't look very comfortable. Don't... I suppose you can house these two together. Like, I don't see any, like, negatives to it. Um, if they, if the crocodile skinks do breed, the dumpty frogs may try to eat the babies if they're small enough. So I wouldn't recommend it. Um, yeah, they're, they're really cool looking animals. Uh, they got that red eyed and there's the white eyed crocodile skinks too. But they look like dragons and they got the ridges on their backs. They're very cool animals. Uh, live in the water. No. Have horns. Technically not. Hooves. Nope. Smaller than a human. Absolutely. Hairy. Nope. Reptile. Absolutely. Starting to get down the right track, Aconator. Not a heavy animal. Very small. Only gets uh, about 8 inches at max. Animal green. No. Does not eat people. Have spikes. Oh, plenty. Beard. No. Magical. I'd like to think it is, but no. Found in pet stores. In specialty pet stores, but no, not typically. Come on. Roll into a ball. No. Does your animal live in the desert? No, they live in uh, tropical environments. Um, is your animal a pet? Not really. Scary? No. Ah. Uh, a tuatara. Which is... Uh, a very interesting animal. It's not a lizard. It's uh basically when reptiles split into uh, two different families, they split into lizards and tuataras, and they are basically a very ancient animal. Very cool. They're uh, endangered right now, but no, it is not a tuatara. Continue. Yes. Is your animal bigger than your foot? No. So every animal today, Akinator has not been able to guess in a single uh, go. Have a curly tail. Oh, no. It Sight reloaded. It made me click wrong. <sighs> Has your animal got the uh, size of a small pebble? No. Primarily insects? Yes. It's going to say chameleon now. No, it doesn't change color. It is spiky. Does your animal have one or more horn? Now it thinks it's a Jackson's chameleon. No. Is it taller than a man? No. Does your animal have natural body armor? Yes. Maybe it'll get it now. Often found in Australia. No. I believe, believe they're found in maybe New Guinea, I believe. No. Uh, found in houses. Nope. Uh, can they swim in lava? Do not test that. No. Uh, yes, they have scales. Uh, have the shape of a ball. Nope. It got the rainforest. Yeah. 
kept in a pocket? No, don't do that. Can your animal be eaten? Well, can't anything be eaten? There's a dude who ate an entire plane part by part. But no, they they shouldn't be eaten. Please don't eat them. Does your what? Does your animal soften kids? What does that even mean? Does your animals no? Does your animal live in fresh water? I'm gonna say probably. Hiss. No. Can it be green? No. Lay eggs. Yes. Is your animal pink? No. Black. Yes. Be found in a pet shop. Uh I'm gonna say probably. Even though I said no before. Oh <gasps> it got it! It did it! The mad lad! Is this the same picture that popped up here? Oh, it is. A red-eyed crocodile skin. I don't like this picture because, like, clearly someone put it there. Like, they're, if they're not climbing animals, they, they might be able to climb this. But they mainly live in, like, moss and, like, under, like, logs and stuff. Like, this is a great picture that dictates the kind of environment it's found in. They're really cute. I love these things. Anywho, yes, he did it. Well, anyway, that's all I have for you today. If y'all liked the video, drop a like. If y'all liked it, uh, if y'all want to see more of this, subscribe, hit the bell. Uh, if y'all don't, hit the dislike. I don't need no simps. Uh, and that's it for today. I hope y'all have a great rest of your day. Have a good one, guys. I missed the stop recording button. Have a good one, guys.